In today's topic, I am going to talk about how AI is helping for HR teams. So most of the companies nowadays, they start using the AI based programs. Today, I am going to talk about more into that topic. Let's get started. Hello all, I am Rambal from Aspera. Happy to see you again. So basically what happened if any job opening is coming from any one of the company, minimum, minimum 100 to 200 people are applying. Already we were discussing the same scenario in little earlier in my AI introduction topic. Is there any human work power is being involved, then the AI will be implemented. So this is a bottom thumb rule for AI. Right, so here the HR people from the companies, they are facing this kind of a problem. Reason is in India, we have a very good population and there are a lot of qualified people are out there. And if any companies are having any job opening, minimum of 200 to 300 people are applying on that job. If you are a HR, how will you handle this 200 to 300 resumes? So will it be possible to read or go through all the resumes and filter it by manual? Is it possible? Definitely it's possible, but it takes a lot of time, right? So to save the time and working very efficiently, the AI will be playing a very vital role here. So most of the companies, they are using ATS. ATS is nothing but applicant tracking system. So this applicant tracking system is basically it's scanning our resume and it's filtering the resume based on the keywords. So if you have a relevant keywords and uh, more efficient keywords in your resume, then this ATS, that applicant tracking system program, will be shortlisting your resume. All right. So now this is a very, very difficult for a job seeker people. Here the interesting website is playing a vital role. The website name called SkillSinker. So this is the one I'm going to walk through now. All right, so this is a SkillSinker website. So this website is basically free resume keyword scanner and job applicant tracker for job seekers. So this tool is identifying the skill and keywords missing from your resume when compared to your job description. So based upon the job description, this tool will be uh, scanning your resume and it will be giving the recommendation what are the things are missing in your resume. So you can be able to upload your resume and this will be giving the score and uh, what is the skills matches, soft skill matches, other keyword matches, degree and title matches. So these are the keywords has been missing in this based upon the job description, based upon your resume, it's comparing and analyzing the job description and your resume. Based on that, this is the result. So this sort of a result you may get and what you have to do, you have to include these keywords or include these um, informations into your resume and you can check with your resume so that you can be able to um, fulfilling this ATS program and also you can be able to enhance your resume based on these feedbacks. So this is one of the fantastic tool. You can try it out for your resume and also wherever you are applying the job, you can take the job description and you can upload your resume and you can check and analyze and also you can enhance your resume. All right. So I hope you like this topic and if it is useful for any one of your friend circles, please share it to them. They will also get benefit out of it. And keep learning, keep explore. I will catch you soon with another interesting topic. Until then, bye-bye.